What's up guys, it's Mario here, back with another video, and in this one we're gonna talk a bit about the topic of weight regain after a period of dieting. And this is related to a brand new study, fresh research, it just came out, and in this study what they've done is they've uncovered a brand new mechanism for why our bodies want to regain weight after a period of dieting. And not just the weight that they, we lost, and not just the fat that we've lost, but also a little bit more. And it's actually not just related to the fat that we've lost, but it's also related to the muscle mass that you might have lost during dieting. And it's a fact that your body will keep gaining weight until it regains the lean body mass, which is a whole new thing because we know in the past, I mean, there are certain adaptations as you go on a diet, if you lose a whole bunch of weight, your hunger will go up, your feeling of fullness will go down, there will be certain things happening and ad adaptations that will drive overeating until you get back to that previous point, that settling point, that homeostatic point. But with this new study, this is very fascinating, it actually uh, puts more emphasis on why we must engage in resistance training, why we must have a good diet set up with plenty of protein, with good sleep, so we can minimize that lean body mass because if we lo lose a ton of lean body mass, what's gonna happen is that, of course, we're gonna regain the body fat, but we're also gonna keep gaining weight until the lean body mass gets back to the previous point, which is so critical because we know how most people diet. I mean, just looking at the average Joe following fad diets, all kind of bullshit marketing, it's usually juice cleanses, restrictive diets, some kind of crazy cleanse or some kind of weird thing where they're just eating avocados or they basically do no resistance training, they just do cardio or they don't do any activity at all, right? We can see now how most people end up in trouble. We can see how most people end up losing and regaining the same 10, 15 pounds every single year. And not just that, they keep ending up with a little bit more weight every single time they go through a diet cycle. And this is often called yo-yo dieting. I mean, most people are very horrible at this and they keep wondering, why am I regaining this weight? And I mean, there's many other factors, of course, people going to a quote unquote diet mentality, you know, they just do it for the short term, nobody's looking at a lifestyle change, people want magic pill solutions, there's all kinds of other uh, bullshit out there, you know, apple vinegar diet, you know, stuff like that. But when we look at how most people just approach dieting in general, it's rarely resistance training, high protein, a balanced approach, lifestyle changes. It's usually a simple crash diet. And we know now why this gets so many people into trouble. So I know you watching this video, you probably lift weights. I mean, you probably do resistance training. You probably get a sufficient amount of sleep. You probably get your protein, but most people don't. And we're kind of a minority. If you're doing all these things, you're a minority. And for us, it's kind of important to spread the message for why this is happening, for why most people are regaining. And this is something we can do. We can educate and we can help people understand why are they in so much trouble. And for those people, of course, that want to listen, most people will want to listen if we approach this in a very smart, intelligent way. Of course, there'll always be someone who is not going to want to listen, but that's up to them because eventually they will because they're going to fail so many times that they will must admit that something is wrong. And it's also, I mean, a little bit sad when you look at all the bullshit marketing that is still advocating crash diet, that is still advocating some kind of nonsense where we can see how much damage that's doing now because people will lose lean body mass. People definitely lose a ton of muscle mass following like some kind of crash diet, like the biggest loser where the goal is to lose weight. The goal is not to lose fat. And in the biggest diet show, they put them on a ton of cardio or a ton of activity to lose even more weight they also have to lose muscle mass because muscle mass obviously adds to weight. And of course you can win the show, but we know what happens afterwards. Most of them regain all the weight and more. So just something I wanted to share with you guys. I mean, I'm a little bit tired of uh, constantly telling people to do resistance training and to lift the uh, heavy and to eat their protein and to get their sleep and invest time in a higher quality diet and an active lifestyle. And we see, I mean, these things are important and no matter how many times I repeat it, 
I probably need to say it even more because this is the message we want to spread. And speaking of long-term weight maintenance, we know certain other things help a lot, such as social support, having an, a nice peer group of people who are on your team, someone who is supporting you there. Also things like really learning about foods and knowing why certain things happen. And this is one of, uh, let's say an example of this video is where it's teaching you why certain things happen. And that's why I want to share with you guys these in-depth mechanisms so you understand why is it happening so it's not just oh i'm gonna lift heavy but it's also you understand okay what happens if i don't live heavy and for me personally when i understand the why it helps me implement the habits it helps me implement and take action because i always need a reason i can't just blindly follow and i know all of you guys are like that i mean you just don't want to blindly follow something you want to know and understand why is that so critical so keep the protein high guys keep lifting heavy Progressive overload, should be getting stronger even on a diet. Make sure to get your sleep, high quality diet, active lifestyle. And that's the final message I wanna share with you guys. Let me know in the comments below how you resonate with this. Have you ever actually met a friend or someone in let's say your family or maybe you yourself that has gone through a crash diet and that they've yo-yoed back to even more weight than they had before. So let me know in the comments below. Do you know anybody that, that has gone through multiple cycles like this? I know plenty of people like that, but I'm curious how you guys have experience with that. Aside from that, make sure to hit that like button below. It really helps a lot with the channel to grow the channel and also uh, helps with YouTube to get these videos out to as many people as possible so they educate themselves, they know more about uh, how to properly change their lifestyle, get to a healthy body weight, build that ultimate physique and live a happy life. So thank you guys for watching again. Hit that subscribe button below if you haven't already and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.